Michael Irvin is known as the playmaker. That word says it all about the wide receiver who redefined the meaning of big play. I don't think I've ever been around a player uh, on any level of coaching that brought as much charisma to a football team. Uh, Michael always had that great ability to bring uh, just excitement to the huddle, excitement to the practice field, uh, could electrify a stadium by not only his, his playmaking, but the way that he played. And, uh, you know, Michael's, uh, you know, his personality will always stand out as one of the great uh, athletes that I've ever had a chance to be around. Irvin came to the Hurricanes from St. Thomas Aquinas High in Fort Lauderdale. And after redshirting as a freshman, he moved into the starting lineup along with Vinny Testaverde and immediately became an impact player. But what the fans didn't see was the work behind the scenes that laid the foundation for success. People may not have understood what a terrific worker Michael was. Uh, he had just a tireless practice but I went out and go 100% every single practice, stay after practice, run, his off-season preparation, just the countless hours of unselfishly going out all by himself, uh, seeing Michael ringing wet uh, in the middle of those hot summer uh, afternoons in, in South Florida, and his preparation for those big games he was going to play in the fall. Looking to throw again, he's going deep, has Irvin, touchdown Miami. Irvin's career was a montage of big plays one after the other, helping the Hurricanes to a record of 33 and three in his three seasons as a starter. The huge touchdown pass that he uh, caught against Florida State over Deion Sanders that helped us win the national championship. I mean, that play really, uh, maybe it put Michael on the map. It certainly put our program and, our, and, and the entire season on the map that year. Walsh again is well taken care of. Locked in the ball, Irvin is open. After catching the winning touchdown pass in Miami's national championship victory over Oklahoma in the Orange Bowl, Irvin turned professional and with Butch Davis and Jimmy Johnson on the sidelines, helped the Dallas Cowboys win back-to-back -back Super Bowl titles. Uh, he got to the Cowboys a year before any of the coaches that left Miami and eventually joined the Cowboy organization, but uh, it was always a warm relationship. I think that there was a lot of respect because of mutual uh, successes. Uh, I think Michael recognized the coaches that went to the Cowboys, how much we shared in common, and that it was truly like being a family member. Uh, uh, you spend 10, 12 years around somebody, and, and you can't have uh, anything but love and devotion and affection for somebody that means that much to you. Tonight, we welcome the playmaker, Michael Irvin, into the University of Miami Sports Hall of Fame.